As Lauren mentioned, folks, she's in the house. She is here, the brand new Miss South Carolina 2015, Miss Daja Dial. Good morning. Good morning. How Miss are South you? Carolina. It's still crazy to hear you say that. Oh, wow. Oh, wow. <laughs> Daja, take us back to Saturday. Okay. The moment where it was you and Mrs. Was it Greater, Greater Greer. Greer? Yes. What was that like? I'm just going to be honest. I've had this question before and they okay. say, well, what do you think in that final moment? And honestly, I was thinking that Greater Greer and Greenville County sound a lot alike in that uh, moment. Yeah. So, you know, you're sitting there and you're hanging on every last letter that they're saying out loud. And um, but that's just the honest truth that I'm sitting here thinking, well, those two sound a lot uh, alike. And, I, and, if she, and if they say one word, it's like, wait a minute. No, it's not me. It's Greater Greer. Right, or if right. it's Greenville. Wait, did they say Greer? Exactly. I got you. Wow. <laughs> Okay, we, we do have a clip um, up from a Saturday night. Um, this is the clip of you, you, you singing. You were singing to Fantasia. Yes. Yeah. Talk to us about that song selection. Well, it's like I was able to tell the judges in my private interview, that song has become more than just a talent piece for me. It's almost become a motto or an anthem, and it's something that I could spread across the state because we know that people need to believe in themselves, and that's exactly what I had to do. I competed in this four times before I won the South Carolina. So it's about believing in yourself to the point where you'll never give up on your dreams and until it make, you know, until they come true. Well, speaking about uh, believing in yourself, one of the major things about uh, becoming Miss South Carolina, you all have platforms. Right. Talk to us about your platform. My platform is type one and type two diabetes mellitus and it stemmed from my older brother's diagnosis with type one in December of 2009, yes. So um, since then, my family and I have either held fundraisers or been a part of different fundraisers raises within Spartanburg or Greenville County um, to raise money for not only the American Diabetes Association but Children's Miracle Network as well which as you know is the Miss America national platform. Right. Mm -hmm. And speaking about Miss America you know yes. what's next for you get gearing up for Miss America correct? Right well before that my <laughs> teen Sarah Hamrick who is the new Miss South Carolina teen she's preparing for Miss America's outstanding team so we have to get her ready for that first and right. help her prepare um, because her competition is only six weeks away <laughs> well, yeah. and so I have a little <laughs> more time until September to prepare for Miss America but in in the meantime, in between time, we'll get Sarah ready as yeah. well as myself. Oh, wow. Any last minute of comments? Anything else you want to tell to the people who's watching South Carolina right now? What do you want to tell them about you becoming the new face of South Carolina? Well, I made a, I, I came up with a quote um, that I put in a People's Choice video that Miss South Carolina had us all make, and it's something that I want to spread across the state. And what I said was, I want people to know that if they believe in themselves, believe in their rights, and believe in their future, then no matter what adversity or loss they face, they will learn a lesson and they will be greater because of it. Oh, wow. Miss South Carolina 2015, Daja Dial, ladies and gentlemen. Thank you so much for being here oh, this thank morning. You really so do much. appreciate thank it. You. Thank, thank you. Thank okay. you. Folks, stay with us. There's more Good Day Columbia coming up right after this.